What's up, Flipsetters? So we need to talk right now. Um, first off, just saw Dawn of the Planet of the Apes, and holy crap. Secondly, I when I tri trimmed my beard earlier, I left like a couple of hairs right here on my chin. It's been driving me nuts like the whole movie. But anyways, it's one o'clock in the morning, and I should be in bed right now because I have church in like five hours or six or something. I don't know. But I had to come see this movie tonight. Like, I just really wanted to go look at all these movie trailers. Or movie posters. I, that's so, I love the movies. But anyway, the movie was so good. Oh my gosh. That's the first time in a long time where I've just been like, ah, oh, that movie was so awesome. Like, I've like really enjoyed movies before, but this was like legitimately just the, oh, so good. I look totally green under the side. I look like an alien. But, oh gosh, I can't give anything away. But, you have to see this movie. You have to see this movie. It's really, really good. Um, holy crap, the CGI is good, man. It's really good. There's a couple times where it's like, it's close on the apes. Like, the movie is about the apes. And I think, I would venture to say that apes are in this movie way more than humans are. And like, half of it's subtitled. It's like a foreign film. But then the apes start talking more. It's just like, it gets intense. Like, Caesar, the main guy played by Andy Serkis, he's like, he, that dude commands authority. I mean, it's awesome to watch this guy and, like, how the rest of the monkeys respond to him. And, dude, when that, this guy talks, you, you shut up and listen because this guy means business. He's like head honcho monkey man. Oh! And then some stuff happens and some other stuff happens that I can't talk about because I don't want to ruin it. But it, you got to see this movie. Oh, I loved it. I loved every bit of it oh, so much. And uh, let's see. Let's see. Uh, I want to talk about something, but I just I don't want to ruin anything. All the humans did good. Um, but the monkeys, dude, they, they look so good. They look so real, too. Like, probably like 10 years from now, I'm going to look back on this and just be like, those monkeys didn't look real. But, <laughs> yeah, they did. It was, oh. And it was, like I said, it was all about the monkeys. And it's like close up on the monkeys. And they all look super real. There's only one part where I was like, eh. But that was like super tiny as in the dark. I mean, maybe it was probably me. But holy crap, they look so good. It's like they were real apes. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. And I came and saw it by myself. Never came to a movie by myself before. Because I always thought it would be sad and depressing to come see a movie by yourself. That's why I always said I said that to people. And be like, whenever I'm here in the theaters, I see someone alone. I'm like, oh, I've never been down here before. I'm probably going to die. I'm always like, I feel bad for that guy back there because he's all by himself. And that would be sad. And like boring come to movies by so but it's not that's like the way to do it because when you're with someone you're, you're like chatting with them or you're like looking over to see if they're reacting to what you're reacting to and then after the movie it's like hey what do you think about the movie unless you go to the movies with like someone awesome it's like wow that movie's crazy what do you think blah, 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 blah. but going to the movies by yourself is like the way best it's like what is back here I feel like I'm gonna die. But that's the best way to watch a movie. If you're going to like the movies, like I, I'd prefer obviously, like if I go, not always gonna go to the movies by myself now. But if you want to like actually sit and watch a movie, it's the way to do it. It's just by yourself because there's no distractions. I was sitting up front row, boom, 10:30 show. Where am I? <laughs> never been back here it's one o'clock in the morning and this is like the sketchiest place to be right now but it's okay because i'll but what that's some sci-fi stuff right there but oh the next movie oh it's gonna be the whole movie it's like no no just don't do that it's like in one person and one monkey and it's just it's just like there was one step behind and you're like no don't do it it's it's one of those movies where it's like what it's this yellow pipe look at this it's probably really
really important. It's probably a yellow for a reason. <laughs> oh, there's civilization. What if I turn the corner, I'm like, oh, there's civilization, and there's like drug dealers over there. I don't even know how I'd react. If there's, I'd probably <laughs> run, but... <laughs> Okay, well now I'm on the other side of the building, and <laughs> it's, it drops down to the road here. And so I gotta go back around. Oh, wait, hold on. I might not have to. But it's like, the movie is just like, it's like roller coaster the whole time. <sighs> I'm like exhausted, but it was so good. I want to see it again. I have to see it again. Oh, there's like a family right there. Look at there's a oh there's a whole like exit thing here. Okay, I'm just gonna walk through. There's families in the movie theater with me. They, this door's locked. I'm gonna really look creepy. Like, who comes in this entrance? I don't. I don't even think this is like a. Oh, it's a real entrance. We'll go back through this way. Why? Because <laughs> we can. I'm gonna come to the movie theater every single time for the rest of my life through those doors. Okay, I'm gonna go to my car now. Cause I'm. I need to go to bed. <laughs> Whoa! Look at the. Posters are even big right here. Oh, I love the movies so much. Haven't seen Transformers. Don't really care if I do. Because Transformer movies are cool, but they suck. You know what I mean? They're like cool to look at. They turn the lights off. <laughs> I'm, I'm still here. All right, I'm leaving. Um, but seriously, guys, go see Dawn of the Planet of the Apes. So good. And if you haven't seen Rise of the Planet of the Apes, go watch that. Because that's good, too. You, oh, gosh, guys. If you're not, if you haven't seen these, you're missing out. And I don't really remember a lot of Rise of the Planet of the Apes. I remember I really liked it. I don't remember, like, hardly anything about it except, like, major plot points. And there's, like, a part towards the end. <sighs> will blow your mind. But anyway, I'm going to go now, finally. As soon as I get to my car. Because I'll be bored if I walk like the last 20 feet to my car all by myself. And why would I want to be bored if I don't have to be? <sighs> Full moon. Werewolves. That's fantastic. I need to put these on or else like, I can't legally drive. Because I'm legally blind. Not blonde. Blind. Look at this. Look at the parking job. Okay, this is a compact spot, right? Boosh. I don't know if you can tell. But look at that. For a legally blind guy. It's not bad. All right, I'm going to go. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to click those like and subscribe buttons if you haven't already. And for the love of Pete's sake, go see this movie. It was so good. Best movie I've seen all year so far. Best movie. I really like some of the movies that I've seen. Edge of Tomorrow was good. Captain America was good. X-Men was awesome. That was really good, too. Man, this has been a great year for movies so far. And there's a lot more good movies that are coming out I'm super excited for Hobbit at the end of the year and freaking Guardians of the Galaxy it looks interesting I'm curious about the movie I want to see it uh, but you gotta see this again or see this once I guess at least Hercules looks cool and uh, there's another movie ah dang it I don't remember but I should get home uh, go to bed thanks for watching guys don't forget to click the like and subscribe buttons if you haven't already Said they're ready. Go see this movie, and I will see you guys on the flip side.